How long will my hip replacement last? This is a common question that many patients ask me before proceeding with a hip replacement. And to be fair, it's an extremely important question for the patient to know. There is some good long-term evidence on the implants that I use, and we're gonna go over those implants. Most of the implants that I use have been around for 15 to 20 years, and 99% of them are still on the road 15 to 20 years later. The implants that I use are made in New Jersey, and they have an excellent track record. A hip replacement is made of multiple parts. One, the first one, it goes into the femur, and this is called the stem. The stem acts as the new head for what you put on, for most patients, a pink head ball. These two stems, or this combination of stem and head ball, have an excellent track record. This is why I use them. I think my patients deserve the best quality implants. Now, there are two different types of stems. There's the stem that is rough, designed for the bone to grow into it for long-term results. And then there's the stem that is smooth. This is a cemented stem. I am versatile on both techniques as they suit different patients. Both of them have excellent long-term data, and that is why I use them. The cemented stem is better for elderly women with osteoporosis to decrease the risk of post-operative fracture, and in my experience, actually leads to a quicker recovery in elderly women versus the presbyte stem. Both of them do the same thing with putting a head ball in to work as the new hip replacement. The second part of the hip replacement is a cup. This cup has been around for a long time, or at least its predecessor has been, and it again has good 15-year data. So the bottom line is how long will my hip replacement work? That depends on the patient, but most of the hip replacement data that we have for the parts and pieces that I use, 90 to 95% of them are around 15 years later. The special caveat to that is after you make it through the first year, which is when most of the hip complications occur, the chance of you needing a redo hip replacement is a half a percent to a quarter percent a year. If you'd like to talk to me more about hip replacements and their implants, be more than happy to evaluate you at Carolina Regional Orthopedics.